Hello and welcome to Live On, a day of billions custom map. On this map we play a surviving commander and have to lead our people through the zombie apocalypse. We can find other survivors on the map that provide us with technology. Most importantly the wood workshop, stone workshop and the foundry can't be built until you find the right settlement that provides you with those techs. There are also some events happening throughout the run where you can choose to help other survivors or keep your resources for yourself. Ultimately, you do have to survive the zombie hordes with the final one happening around day 90. So this is a nice map where you have to figure out for yourself how you want to build, explore. And it does have some story elements to it, which makes it a bit more unique. This map is a bit older, but I think it was created before the map editor was able to create any upgrades or buff zombies. So we're playing on the vanilla settings. Neither the zombies nor my own units are buffed. I actually quite like the map. I think it was a pretty nice design and having to find the technology and have some events made it a bit more unique in comparison to a lot of other maps. I hope you enjoy the run. Scout the north. And then the rangers secure the housing area. Oh, gates can say the gate. Hater. Well, maybe. Uh, reporting in, Commander. Unfortunately, we have nothing of note to report from our reconnaissance mission. However, we did rescue several survivors and salvage some resources. I like that. Do that again. I, your I shall candidates. take the farm check. Oh, oh, there's a gate here. Nope, we gotta get rid of that. Okay. Jeez, there's a lot of things going on. <laughs> Commander, our scouts have reported seeing a smokestack rising from the forest in the northwest. Based on the regular reports from our patrol scouts, it is not a natural occurrence. Could it be possible that some survivors are attempting to signal us for assistance? It is worth checking out, sir. Well, we have some troops in the north, so let's go. Um, okay, maybe we scout from left to right. So I don't miss any places. All gates destroyed? Yeah, I'm feeling a lot better now. Units under attack. Well, one of my rangers not feeling better. Okay. okay, that's a dead end. I guess you go over here, you defend here. No! Wow. <laughs> Wait, I didn't get an alert for this one, did I? I feel like I didn't get an alert. Well, this is going great. Thank God, and thank you for finding me. As those words left her lips, the girl before your eyes let out a sigh of relief. You could see she is visibly shaking, sobbing silently. By the looks of exhaustion and worse for wear, this girl has survived in the wilds long enough as one of your hunters approaches her. She lifts her head and says, My name is Zoe. I was out of here camping with several of my friends from the hunting club. You can tell she is distraught when mentioning her friends. She continues saying, I am the only one left now, while crying. I saw smoke rising and several hours of gunshots and explosions. I was overjoyed but afraid to leave as well, for fear of the commotion having attracted more of the undead. Thank you. Thank you so much for rescuing me. Oh, my pleasure. Zoe, I'm so sorry for your loss of your friends. Please stand up and steal yourself now. This area is not safe. Pack your belongings and gather yourself. We will be moving out to head back to your enclave. There will be time to mourn once we are all safely behind the enclave's walls. Well, not of those walls still exist, but yeah, sure. Thank you, sir. Um, by the way, I was an engineer by trade before the outbreak. I hope I'm able to contribute my expertise as my way of thanks. Ooh, here we found some tech. 50 minutes later, so we packed up like luggage and went to the base with the soldier. I, uh, her luggage, right? Okay. Oh, bring the ranger down here. See? 
Not too bad I lost the ranger, we found more rangers. All according to plan. Okay, I still need food though, so... I guess I'm gonna put some walls there just in case, maybe once the soldier is back. Um, just who knows um, how many zombies there are. Oh, she get Oh, I thought we just got the tech, but we actually can just build the things. Oh, that's even better. Wait, did I miss a path here? Let's get some stone. I might need a soldier center anyway, too. Oh, wait, yeah, um, it's hard to see these things, I feel like. Maybe it's just me. The rangers are still pulling too much. Okay. Oh, no, this is a path. Let's go. Maybe this was the dead end. Okay, let's explore the other way first. I want to get all the dead ends out of the way. Well, this is 19, so let's start here. I guess we build, can build energy, 11. Oh, and I need a power to get in there. You help out here. Oh, they have text too, some of them? Oh. Mila Jovovich and... Frederick and Trias. Okay, but this is clear too. Okay, so we, that was clear. Just ran back for nothing. Okay. I was like the map maker knew that Kenzie was going to sacrifice rangers. <laughs> no. I just wanted to make the map more interesting. Not me. I am pulling a lot of zombies. Wait, does this connect here? Oh, no. It goes somewhere here. Okay, this is a dead end. Let's check that north there. And do Let's not destroy them all just yet. Okay, this way I still get the sawmill in there, hopefully. Over here. Oh wait, we have farm tech already. Oh, I got that. Uh, maybe I need to focus on the farming here. If we had like more rangers, like if the map maker gave you like more rangers at the start, that would be nice. It's definitely not my fault for losing them or something. And to cottage here. Okay, we do a hundred cottage here, and then in case there's something spawning in the north, we block this. Did I just grab my soldier now though? I guess I did. Okay, well, I guess come out here then. Fair enough. Well, that's also not what I wanted to do, but you know. I'm playing well today. Okay, let's just get a soldier center then. I have no iron actually, huh? I was hoping to go with snipers right away or something, but... Oh, there was one more path here. Oh, oh, that's the one you meant probably. Oh, well. This is awkward now, I just rebuilt this. We'll go there eventually. <laughs> Great. 
Okay. Yeah, it could be hiding tech, so I should go back there, but... I'll build another ranger and send it back there. I feel like I'm a bit, bit spread thin at the front here, so I don't want to pull another unit away again. That's why. I do have a free market though, so I might as well use that for some food as well. That's the cheapest way in there is destroying a Soma for the second time. Totally not awkward doing that all the time. Isn't that an A? No. Okay. I think for some joke points or something. Well, nope, destroyed it for nothing. Okay. That's okay too. Ooh, there's iron over here. Okay, we want that. We want that. Sure, it'll destroy it again. Yeah, maybe I'll rebuild other things first. We have other locations where I can build uh, wood income too. Okay, well, this is combining. Okay, maybe maybe this is a pocket that would be nice. Uh, less energy needed. That is excellent. Now I don't want to build units because we're getting the iron here, so we can swap for straight to snipers or something. It's a very nice housing area, yeah. So the, I guess the soldier center was kind of wasted. Especially if you don't lose all your troops right at the start. You know. We'd get a warehouse though. Maybe we'll build one warehouse for this side and then one for this. Yeah, maybe one here and one somewhere here. Yeah. Maybe there's a lot of runners and stuff up there. Any orders? Okay. This better be good. It's a bit more wood. Well if someone didn't destroy their sawmills all the time. We'd have better wood income. How much is this? Ooh, that's 20. Well, I'll take that. So I was getting the Norfolk division. Well, I can't build here because this is edge of the map. So otherwise I'd also expand into here and get a lot of um, hunting colleges. But we, yeah, we can't get in there. So, and build that close to the edge of the map. Since this all ends in dead ends, I feel like no zombies will spawn there, but I'm not sure also. That's why we have some... Um, safety walls there. Never trust map makers. Um, that's just some free advice I'll give you. Oh, also, this is misplaced. Let's fix that. Okay, looks like there's a goes towards a bit of a better choke point potentially here. Look on that. Get to the iron. Okay. I mean, the rangers are still having trouble over there. Can't say it's going well for them. First try on the map? Yep, first try. So far. Oh yeah, I guess there's waves too. Um, I mean... I think that might be possible with traps on a map like this. We'll go traps and then see how that goes. 
if I regret that decision or not. Maybe I'll build an extra ranger for kiting though. Because otherwise we'll be spread a bit thin. Okay, we can defend maybe over here, this side for now. Right a bit there. Hey, Commandos. I mean, I still can kill a few more zombies here. Reporting in, Commander. We found iron ore in the east, and we did rescue several survivors and salvaged some resources. Well, nice. I just say, these mini-events are kind of neat. Maybe because we walked far enough forward we got this one for the urn here. You have to actually clear or get on the other side of it, not just close. So I can't research the stone workshop, so I guess we have to find that too. Um, now I'm wondering... I was saying saying we do the first wave with traps, but I guess Ballista is a bit safer, right? We can kill more in case it's like a bigger wave than I thought, and we probably want to defend one of these sides anyway and then push the other side. I'm de debating if I want to tech for Ballista instead. Let's do that. I mean, I'm kind of hoping to get to a better choke point down here though, in that case. If to build it in the middle of nowhere, it's going to be a bit awkward. Get another rear house in here. Oh yeah, maybe I'll try pushing a bit more here. Get one ballista, uh, not ballista, Tesla tower here. Uh, a timely reappearance. The dungeon awaits. Uh, here, so we can defend there. Does. Two feet to fly, well thank you for the 19 months. Will rope tents bring you pain? No, that's fine. They're a long-term plan, because there's going to be a bank there. It be so it'll be better later on. This doesn't look as pretty right now. But there is a point to it. This looks like a decent choke point, maybe. Oh, if maybe if this is close to you, maybe this line. Oh, I don't don't think we can get that in one day. Maybe we can try. Build the nice light tower. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll start getting some iron already. We get sniper check soonish. Maybe. And should probably make sure I have enough um, energy for Ballistas when it happens. Okay. Oh, maybe this is not closed here. From the north. Okay. Wait. Like this north? Oh, but this is also maybe this north. Well, apparently there's also a harpy up there. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Sure, sure. Why not? Gives me a bit more time down here, though, so that's good. We don't need to build the defensive stair just yet. It's 10 wood. No, I can't build the sawmill here. It's too close to this one, if you meant this there. Okay, it is coming there. Good. <laughs> It came here, it would have been awkward. I mean, I would have destroyed this, built a bunch of ballistas, and hope we had enough time, but it would have been a bit awkward. Uh, let's rebuild this sawmill here. I'm sure this time it'll be fine. Oh, okay. No, it's fine. 
We're fine with two ballista here. I wonder if this is close towards the south now. Um, <sighs> I'm not getting Lucifers. I mean, maybe there's a free Lucifer on the map, for all we know, but... Or maybe we'll find a free Lucifer. Free iron. Yeah, I could have gotten the traps and then destroyed them for a golden iron, but... Gotta give Jet hope sometimes, you know. Okay, if we have Ballista here, and move. Maybe the soldiers go here, and then Rangers a bit forward. He'll defend here for now, and then I'll have to decide where I want to expand to, I guess. Uh, and for expanding, we want snipers, so let's get snipers. Let's go. I'm still hoping this is closed here, but I'm, I'm feeling a bit less confident about that. There is farming over here, though. And there was the north spawn there, so I kind of want the defenses here. Would have been nice if I got, would have gotten there in time. But, I mean, there's also food here. But it kind of feels like this side would be easier to claim. Okay, I think the soldiers are making too much noise, actually. Yeah. <laughs> They're getting my rangers killed. And that soldier behavior. Oh, also pulled a harpy. Okay. Maybe a second soldiers enter, and then we can go double snipers. How much for building defenses here before I push? Should claim the other iron here though. 14 and 14. We'll build it here then. Commander, my name is Yuan and I'm from the survivors enclave called Hope, just west of here. Oh, maybe the path here is going to them then. Without meaning to sound imposing and the risk of being shameless, our situation is desperate after surviving an assault by a massive horde. We require the following resources urgently. Please, Commander, I beg of you, assist us. And you would. Or, I'm so sorry, we're barely surviving with what we have. Leave, we are not a charity. No, no, we're nice. Give them some wood. We have plenty. I rebuilt the uh, sawmill three times so we can spare spare some wood now. You again? Yeah. What? You again? Are you sure? You okay, are there's a decent amount of um, zombies here. What will be the decision if they ask for stone? Well, we can't save everyone. I mean, that's just... You gotta be reasonable in your requests. No, we'll give it to them too if we can. Always trying to help. Yeah, maybe I'll go here next and then block here and then we can do some farming there. I do want to scout the site. Maybe we can get closer to that um, colony there too. What do you want now? You again? Yeah. They have tried to break through. So maybe the soldiers here and then my snipers. Can already start here a bit. Good day, Commander. My name is Vincent, and I'm from the survivors and clan of Jeffrey. Not far from here. I do travel between several other enclaves when the roads are safer or after a horde has moved on. You have to trade resources. Yeah, sure. What do you have? Uh, you can pay food for wood. Whoever does that trade. Oh, 
we can buy food, yes. Food for wood. Well, that's it. Temporary resources for permanent ones? Hell yes. Or multiple times too? Hell yes. How much wood do I have? Well, not enough, clearly. Okay. And then... I guess good thing we have some iron too. I'm gonna buy all the food I can. Who needs to expand when you can just buy the food? And then I'm gonna complain about not having enough stone in a second, so just you wait for it. Okay. I think we're good for now. Please come back. Very well, sir. I will inform the other enclaves and communities about a new trade route. If you intend to trade or stop by, please head north and you will find the Jeffrey community. You're always welcome there. Oh, we can... Oh, well, we should go north. Once again, thank you and may God bless you. Us through these dangerous times. I guess maybe they're somewhere up here then? Well, that was some nice, um... Hello? Now I do need some energy though. Okay, so we'll just go here. Now that we have... What us. There was a slight commotion at one of the gates. We don't have gates. Shortly a soldier rests in, requesting your presence at said gate. He's an imposter. Shoot him. You scale the ramparts and look down at the gate, seeing a motley group of strangers that look relatively healthy, albeit a bit worse or rare. Hello dear kind sir, we are a band of survivors traveling the road, surviving as best as we can until we come across a traveling trader named Vincent. He told us about your enclave and we decided to come over. We are unable to offer you much, but we offer you our willingness to contribute to your community if you provide a safe haven. Sure. I'm commotion at the non-existing gates, exactly. I don't know if I'll need like a ballista towards this too. I guess I'll, I'll build a um, Tesla tower here and then we can build a tower here too if need be. be oh, I need to find a stone rock drop actually. Because I can't... Um, uh, I can't upgrade or get power plants or stuff like that right now. Oh, I'm pulling a lot here. Yeah, maybe a, maybe a ballista to fall back to wouldn't be the worst thing here. Oh, is there more iron here? Oh, it's a dead end, okay. No, it's not? It is. Okay. I guess I should always have full stone and iron and stuff in case of um, the trader coming back. He's apparently this side. <laughs> I guess the soldiers here are pulling a ton from the south there. But this would be like an easy territory to claim. Apparently it's not. Okay. Well, let's build some defenses towards the north. We know waves can come from here because we already had one wave there, right? So. I guess I could send the rangers and then leave the soldiers here for defense for now. Oh, this probably connects here, okay. Thank you, team man for the 16 months. So far, it's a nice map. I like it. Like it's... Oh, apparently there's chubbies up here. And harpies, okay. Like, yeah, it's some places it tells you a bit how to build, but not everything is foretold. Ooh, we are stone. Nice. And the events kind of make it a bit unique, too. 
a breath of fresh air from the more symmetrical maps. Yeah. It is opening up here though. So but it, but maybe the other um colony that talked to us is here, right? So the quartermaster has reported that our stockpile was broken into. Four of the newer colonists have disappeared as well. Uh, a timely I mean, the it was obvious, awaits. right? They came through a non-existing gate. Something was fishy. Hey, Dorky Duck. So now we know there are negative events as well. Good to know. Okay, I don't know if I find the trader up here or if this is just a dead end. We'll just explore it. Seems just dead end. Yeah. Or is it actually? Reporting in Commander. We found a quarry village in the northeast where there must be the technology we need. And send a unit to carry our further researchers. But there are a lot of zombies scattered here. Please be careful. We only found some supplies during the investigation. Oh. Oh, maybe they. Oh, maybe this up here is. Oh. The question is, if there's a lot of zombies, maybe we shouldn't go there first. Like, that what they're saying. Maybe fall back. We'll do this side down here a bit first, and then come back. Build another warehouse up here actually for the oil. Also means if the trader comes back, we have more resources potentially stored to trade for food. Which I would very much like. Let's expand into the stone. Oh, maybe this is a pocket? That would be fantastic. And maybe let's not block path in here. I feel like I'm gonna build a lot of defenses here eventually, so I don't know if this all this up here will survive long term. But for now we just build some um, stuff there. Octa North, yeah I probably should. I don't, I mean, it doesn't seem like there's much coming unless it's waves, but then again, I guess random waves could start at some point, you never know. Oh, probably a good idea to block it just in case. close to where the zombies are. Wait, is this clear? Good day, kind sir. Zombies broke through our wall three days ago. Jeez, can you guys manage something? And destroyed most of our food stockpile during the stampede. My commander chief has done a stock take and believes we do not have enough food to survive through this week. Please, kind sir, could you spare us some food? I suppose. 
Thank you, thank you so much. I will inform the other communities about your good deeds and generosity so they can mooch of us as hell. No, no. Well, this is gonna be nice here. We'll put a warehouse down there too. If we're coming from this side, I guess we can put the soldiers here now. Rangers in there, we don't need this anymore. I mean, I would like a bank and stone housing, actually. And they did say the tech is northeast, so now I'm tempted to go northeast again, actually. Because this is food area, not housing area, right? So, and I'm running out of space to up, um, build soonish. And we're also getting a lot of stone. Um, hmm. This might be a map where we in the end build a ton of snipers, but I do like power plant energy actually. So let's go with that. If I find power plants back <laughs> eventually. Oh, yeah, I think power plant is better. It's just uh, more workers. It's gonna look funny in the end when we have, you know, a thousand snipers again or something. Oh, this is unfortunate. You can't build there. You build here. Let's see. What if we build this one here? But then I still can't build there. Okay. I mean, getting a lot of stone anyway. Might be a map where we actually get enough stone. There was a slight commotion at one of the gates. Again. Totally, a soldier rushes in, requesting your presence at sent gate. You scale the ramparts and look down at the gate, seeing a motley group of strangers that look relatively healthy, albeit a bit little worse for her. Sounds like the other crew. Hello, dear kind sir. We are a band of survivors traveling the road, surviving as best as we can until we came across. It sounds exactly the same, actually. Yeah, he told us about your enclave and we decided to come over. We are unable to offer you much. I mean, we'll try it again. Right? Gotta, gotta keep the faith in humanity or something. It was more workers, though, this time. Last time it was only M10. Stealing food is bad, yeah, because we lose it permanently. But then again, if we trade for food again and run out of space, then, you know, we get free workers in the end. Okay. I'm gonna kill this here a bit, and then we. I'm actually gonna look for that tech up there, see if we can find that. Yeah, it could also be that the events are... I mean, it, it did say something about random events. So maybe sometimes you get a good effect, or... It could also be follow-up effects, right? Like, they learned you, they can steal from me, so then now they're gonna do it again and again and again. <laughs> that would be mean, but also kind of fun. These build the gates somewhere on the map. No, no, that doesn't make sense. How will we spot uh, the people who are lying if we, you know, have a gate, then it could actually happen. We're not thinking this through. Gates are our lie detectors, after all. Okay, now I'm kind of low on food again, though. But yeah. So now I do, would want to push down here. <laughs> Um, more soldier centers maybe, so we can ramp up these sniper numbers. It did say there's a lot of zombies in the north. Oh, there's a lot coming from down here, actually. Maybe I should build another ballista there. I 
mean, I can't expand here, so I'm not really, like, gaining territory or anything up there. Uh, this is what they talked about, I assume. Yeah, this this looks like Doomtown waves, what's coming there. I mean, we're getting a normal wave in a second, too. Oh, I can find stone. I don't need... I mean, I need stone tech first before I need all that stone. Oh, maybe we can expand from somewhere up down here. Like, maybe there's a path that goes here. Oh, coming from the north. Wait, is this the stone? There's the stone workshop here. Found it. Maybe we got a free one, but there's one here, so maybe we can't expand it then. Okay. Uh, I'll put that there. Okay, and now the housing planning all made sense, because, you know, we can just build here. We'll have to see if there's a path towards it somehow or not. Okay, no, I think we have enough there. Um, oh yeah, actually I could get the inn and food one and stuff like that too already. I didn't think about that, but... Where's Vincent when you need to trade with him? I want to buy some food right now. Yeah, no waves should ever come here because the waves... Like, if the wave spawns here, they'll always um, hit there because it's the shortest path to the command center. Okay, there is a lot of zombies over here. Or at least a lot of harpies. Uh, ooh. Good day, it's Vincent. Well, hello there. I saved some resources to buy some food. Okay, I wish there was bigger options to buy. Like, that would be nice. Oh, it disappeared. I guess I clicked something wrong, but we got some food. Fix the farm, rich farm. Tens on the east corner, we reached this? No. You can't connect outside the map. Uh, back in the day, you could do that. I don't know if the map is that old though. But, like you could do that. Right? Okay. And you would still. I mean, it depends. Yeah, there was one time where you could go over mountains, and then one time where you could still go around the map edge, I think. And then now you can't do either. But currently, I mean, it could still have a connection here, right? Ready. We'll have to see. I mean, if, if we can connect here, which I guess it now it looks like we can, then we can repair it once we go around here, but not for now. 
Uh, well, it seems like those are the people who get broken in by zombies. <laughs> Again. Sure, let's give them food. You better help me big time at some point. It's currently you're all useless. Timely reappearance. The dungeon awaits. What's this? No. Nope. This is not open here. Okay. I guess it's pretty far south, that connection. Let's try to find that. Okay, maybe it's here. Yeah, I probably should have just claimed this uh, stone workshop from the north and then come back and gotten around the south. But it's okay. Let's research power plants. And I mean, I can still get the food one or two. Not that I really have space for it right now. And we're gonna get a lot of food down here too, eventually. Does you buy food and give it away? Isn't it a good deal? Being kind to people, always a good deal, yes. One of our patrols have discovered a poor, starving dog nestled near one of our walls. We have checked the dog for signs of infection, so it seems the dog is in the clear. Could we feed him some food and keep him, sir? Can we fire this guy? Like, that's not even a question. Of course we feed him. Scoutmaster says he could be really useful for alerting us to hidden zombies or for finding survivors. Oh, of course. Even if he's just cute, that'll be enough. I guess I could also open up here and then connect my the path there. Cute dog auto accept the colony. Yeah, if you ever want to kill people on custom maps, the cute dog is a trap. You don't want to carry the barrel. He gets like cleaved by a giant, he's gonna explode everything. What's happening down here actually? Like, are people dying? Or? Let's research that food wonder. Commander, we are currently camped southeast a short distance from Rolling Stone Town. We are planning to move in and investigate Rolling Stone Town tomorrow morning. Okay. Like, this town? I mean, it's already clear. We just want to... Steal my my success there, or <laughs> what's the plan? To find some places to defend. Emergency scouting team transmission. Sir, Ila and Maito are dead. We are ambushed. John and Gero are probably dead as well. Do not send help here. I rip. He do not. Oh God, no! Tell our families we. The transmission is still active. You only hear the sickening sound of bones being snapped and crunching. You motion towards the. You motion towards the signals corpsman to enter transmission and call for the master at arms. You are once again the bearer of bad news to five families. I don't know where they died. Commander George Labs is in the stolen Rolling Stones town. Perhaps we could risk sending a team to investigate and perhaps recover new technological and plans. 
Like, is this the... I don't know where which towns are. <laughs> like this one? But we already claimed that. Let's send the rangers there, maybe. Something. Oh, we could maybe... This is closed. Okay, maybe we can defend here for now. I have too many entry points otherwise. So that's southeast. Oh, okay. Yeah. Well, let's find a choke point here and then we can go southeast or something. Also build power plants. Then stone walls, maybe for the next wave. So the Quasma has reported. Oh, Starbell was broken in. <laughs> yeah, those guys. Puppy! While making your rounds, inspecting the condition of the enclave, you hear an excited bark and the familiar rapid running of paws. Turning around, you see the dog you rescued running towards you, carrying something between its jaws. Dog drops a bottle of canned food at your feet and wags its tail, looking at you earnestly. Seems it wasn't such a bad idea to adopt this dog after all. Morel has increased greatly in the enclave, and everyone has taken a liking to our new furry friend. He already paid for himself. And we didn't even need him to do that. Dogs have always positive effects. Yeah, I mean, we had maps that had like a morale system. There the dog would just increase the morale, which would be kind of neat too. Wait, didn't I research? Didn't? No, I didn't. Yes, I'm blocking pathing now then. Oh well. I did everything. so much protos we're continuing the gifts out very nice okay seems like this is the path south so we can block this for now and then block over here and then decide where we want to go next there's a lot of food Like there's multiple entry points here too. Of course. Okay. So wait, southeast was the town they talked about, right? So do we go south down here or here and then east? I guess. That is the real question. And I'm not a, I'm out of stone. The holder. I don't have the stone for that.
I need to uh, find some oil tech, maybe. Well, this looks like a path to what's another resource stump or something, maybe. Also looks like it could be trouble, like there's a lot of zombies here. And as I said, I did want to go southeast, right? So yeah, maybe, you know, it's not split every virtue. research the found no you have to find the tags on this map well or at least the tech buildings okay i'll build the defenses one tile forward though it was a slight commotion at the gates sure i'm sure See, we can't punch them all because it's only a small group of them who then steal from us right so i don't you know, I don't want to do um, punish all of them, or a few of them being just bad people. I'm getting shit tightened from the in. Look at that. Put the dog on them. <laughs> the guard dog. Oh, but they might hurt the dog. I can't risk that. There's stone up there too. I mean, my stone income isn't bad actually, it's just... I'm just using a lot right now. There's also a giant here. Maybe I should kill the giant though, before we leave the site. Maybe I should have, instead of building all farming here, maybe I should have built one housing area. First of all, we're half the map already and in a low in housing. And there's still... I guess we could also build a housing area maybe here. But this would be a pretty good territory here, actually. Like, it's like, no, no, there's a path, it's just there's no shortcut path anymore here. I mean, I guess I could get the beholder. My machine is ready. Goes oh. us east. So rude. I'm checked that the north village is actually fine, or at least the nearby stuff is cleared. Hey, Jeffrey. Well, I guess 
Like getting a lot of food again. Thinking a bit fast, uh, slower this time, so I'm not cancelling him by accident. Again. Then again, we have nearly <laughs> 1.5k food after this anyway, so it's not like we're starving or something. But yeah, maybe one of those farm areas is going to be a housing area now. I think I'm going to destroy like one row of uh, farming there and do like a proper housing area. I don't think I can build market in banks though, right? We just got the free ones. I don't think I have the tech for it. That's a bit unfortunate. And, and then I guess in that case it doesn't matter where I build. I'll we'll have to double check though. Wait, no, I don't want to turn this around. Okay, I think we're good. Thanks. Yeah, I can't take photos. I guess I don't really... I mean, maybe we'll find another market and bank or something. But until then, it doesn't really matter. I can just build here uh, housing and then... Um, it doesn't have to be like a big area, alright? So I don't need to destroy some farming there for now. Oh, from the north again. Of research trucking towers. I think about it. Let's send some troops back. Oh, oh, I can see the foundry. Okay. And here. No. Oh, and this is part of the map. Okay, so we built the fences here, claim the north, and then do the sneaky path towards the south there. I mean, something is still happening down there. When I reach that. They are attacking the colony okay, it's already chubbies. I mean, already it's nearly day 40. Sir, I have a report. What is it, soldier? Can it wait until this wave has been dealt with? My apologies, sir. We have received an emergency transmission from our armed expedition team camp near the Rolling Stones in Clave. They are reporting they have encountered and linked up with several soldiers still fighting the zombies in Rolling Stones, and they have several tanators with them, sir. They are requesting for reinforcements to extract the remaining tanator suits and equipment. Latest reports indicate they are currently holding position at the barracks and are almost surrounded by a horde. Oh, well, let's head there. Okay. Sounds good. I mean, that was the plan here anyway. Okay, secure this entry path. With one tile down, we can get the just cottage here. Out of influencer? It really? With just a visual problem. Now I have, um, 
You can research the Academy of Immortals twice. I've never seen that. <laughs> okay. So repair that. Does not have energy access. Wait. Wouldn't it be covered? These tents are in terrible positions. Wait, no, you're supposed to go over here. What? If I sent them here, they walk over there. It's kind of weird. food left. I still want more food. This better pay off at some point. I don't destroy all the walls. There is no connection here. We have to go down there as they... I mean, they did do the pathing that way, so it does make sense. It's just unfortunate. There's a slight commotion at the gates. I'm continuing to trust people. Wait, did the last one steal from me already? I don't think they did, did they? That's still outstanding. They did? Oh, they did, okay. Oh, I can't repair this, apparently. It does. It still says it doesn't have access to energy, even though I built like, a Tesla tower right next to it. Interesting. Oh, and uh, again, didn't research my shocking towers. Jeffrey. I like Jeffrey. I just wish we could trade more at a time. Which phone apps? Like five seconds a hectare of PC? Really? For me, the phone is always behind. Like, and not just by a bit, like 30 seconds often. Probably should get more unit production or something. We can clear the map faster. Mm 
Okay, we got all the food we can. I mean, yeah, I guess ideally you'd have just more um, warehouses and then you have more resources so you can trade more when the guy shows up. I want to also boost my... over there. Excuse me? Let's go. Like Man, our point man has discovered something on the head. He has found a tree with birds. Take the west clearing for safe haven and there is a white ribbon tied to the tree as well. Could be an ambush. Should we investigate? Well, of course we investigate. But we're trying to get to high tech stuff right now. So maybe later. Oh yeah, I wanted to get the beholder. Oh, maybe this is the town we've been looking for. I know I can't uh, build Tesla towers. I'm getting a beholder. Jeffrey can only go up to 10. Or 20. Well, he's still uh, very valuable. Just troops in there. Hey, the puppy brings some food again. How the hell did they build their town? I mean, I guess it looks neat, but yeah. Oh my god, Norman. Look, the living. Oh, thank god. So good to see a living face. It given up hope, thinking we were the only ones left here. Our supplies are dwindling, but the sounds of the zombies were too numerous, we couldn't risk venturing out. We were all from the shooting club back before the outbreak. I believe we can be of use to you. Please let us join you. We are an army stationed in the northwest, and the nearby zombies have been cleared by us. We are preparing to go to the town to search for survivors. We will send a team to escort you to the base. Commander, I heard you intend to send an expedition to the southeast to search for survivors. Pardon me, but I would advise you not to do so. Eyewitness accounts and survivors we have met all say one thing. There's hell on earth. All of our scouts have indicated the zombies roaming that area seem to be much stronger and move much faster. Additionally, they spotted harpies and worse. I assumed the faster and stronger would be the harpies. Powering behemoths among the horde. Commander, please trust me on this. Don't send any expedition there. It is impossible that there are any survivors left. Sounds like a fun expedition though. Where are those tenators they talked about? Oh, they're here. Okay. Is this an entry path for zombies later on? Huh. Mm, 
Wait, did I really defend this pocket so well here? <laughs> a bit overkill. Okay, we clear this here. We clear this here. All troop defend the flank. I don't want to build over the farmland all the time, but I guess I still should, huh? It feels wrong, but... I guess it's not. Map is called Live On. Commander, we have an urgent transmission from a friendly enclave further south. Spot a massive horde heading right for Enclave. Based on estimation, they should be at our walls in five days. Or from the south. Well, we're still expanding towards the south. I don't know if I can get my... I mean, I should be able... If I continuously build, we should be able to get the towers down here in time. Which I guess comes from here, most likely. It could also come here. Here, guys, go in there. Commander, oddly enough, there are no zombies in this area. As the squad scans the surroundings, a soldier knows to something. He then rubs his eyes and seems excited on a watchtower nearby. In hush but excited tone, the soldier claims to command a look. The watchtower over at the north. Someone is waving a flag. A steadfast supporter. We found the Lucifers. You can map all farmland because he can't beat it because he doesn't want to build on it. I mean, kind of right, yeah. Commander, you're a sight for sore eyes, sir. My name is Space Commander Mike. I've been holding this barracks for several months now. There are too many zombies outside for us to break out. Moreover, we have hoarded too much heavy weaponry here, and we are unable to bring them all with us. The transport depot was south of the base, and we couldn't reach it in time, while being surrounded. Your armed expedition did not signal us. We thought we were the only survivors left in this area. Glad to see another survivor's holdout, Commander Mike. Sorry to cut your celebrations short. We have to move now. We barely cleared the horde at the entrance to this enclave. You there, heavy gunners, pack up your equipment, but do not fire your rockets. Grab a sidearm or rifle. The rockets will literally wake that from the rest of the base. The rest of you, get whatever resources and ammunition you can find. We're moving out in 15. There we go. Commander, with our current troops, think I would not advise venturing into forward yet. Yeah, we're fine. Rotations respected, Commander. Our surrounding camp does not seem to have much in the way of stone, and there are far too many zombies for us to clear our own. Asked for a kind favor by reminding us with stone as we could repair and reinforce our camp. Urgh. See, they did ask for stone and I provided it. Am I not merciful? Wait, oh, they're attacking my. <laughs> He's attacking the walls and destroying the foundry? 
Wait, no, 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 no. Does that mean I can't get a foundry then? Because I can't tech for it? Oh god. Snipers! Get over there! Through this position. We need to clear up here. I don't think I... I don't know if I can reach him, but maybe I can kill the stone walls. So he doesn't destroy my foundry. Wait, why are you... No. Oh no, I shot the foundry, actually. Okay, I might have saved our tech. But I'm not sure I could rebuild it if it gets lost. here again. Oh, trading with Jeffrey again. Did I kill the bank? I don't know, maybe. Not intentionally. I clicked him away when I clicked too fast, but I don't want to... Oh, I killed the market. I guess the Lucifer burned it down, maybe. Oh, so much for having that. Scouts have reported seeing a herd of wild deer in the vicinity. We should send some of our hunters or to hunt. Takes them two days before they return. Yeah, we have workers. Releasing oh, some stuff to the giants. Gonna be annoying claiming this all to be honest. Like it looks neat that there's a destroyed town, but it's a pain to claim and do stuff with it. And I'm also out of energy, okay. Zombies in the back. Oh, well. I also can't reach the Tesla Tower, some of them. That's not helpful. Ready. 
I'm just trying to get to the tech building right now. Hunters are back. Good. I mean, I'm kind of wondering how I got all the way to the north without uh, triggering all this all the time. Rave that's supposedly coming. Yeah, that's this one, right? <laughs> yeah, the George Lamp first squad, second squad, security pyramid, third and fourth squad with me. We're going in. Oh, we're already in. Found collected all in as a blueprints and plants. Oh, I didn't need to even save it. I can just build it myself now. Oh. Man, at the risk of sounding optimistic, after collecting the reports we have received from the surrounding towns and our scouts, I believe we can weather this massive horde. We can foresee relatively peaceful days, at least a couple of days. Oh, that's pretty long, actually. <laughs> but I haven't beaten that wave yet, so you know, maybe you're a bit too fast. Uh, where do I put that then? Okay. Oh, I can't reach that north part here. Oh no, maybe we through here around it you can. is here. Okay, everyone just chase through this. Also want to build more um, bombers here, I guess. Just everything was busy all the time. Research oil. some stone oh no I sent Jeffrey away again too fast misclicked oh well that's okay we don't need to trade too much oh I can't repair that Sounds 
Attention. Building completed. Okay. Let's get a lot of oil. Well, probably missing some oil somewhere. Put in north. Okay, I'll check in a second. Thank you. Ah, uh, here. Catch. Oh, and one spot here. Scouts have reported that they have discovered a hidden stockpile of stone nearby. Yeah, send some workers to get that. I mean. Wouldn't you? Build anything there anyway. Okay. I mean, if I didn't pick Jeffrey away by accident, we would have food, but I guess I can just build more normal farms. I messed that up. We wouldn't need as many farms. That's okay though. farms anyway um not create my quarries and we get a bit more oil here too nice Engineering center. Uh, I mean, events seem still to happen, I think. Just no way for a while. Oh, we're upgrading food now. Maybe I should um, save up the oil for the oil one first, actually. Or buy it, I guess. That's probably faster. Set by a horde of zombies, we lost six men, sir. We salvaged what we could and returned. Or well, maybe you should have taken some uh, firepower with you. So I'm the only survivor. A group of harpies ambushed us at the pass. You guys seriously put, should bring some of my, you know, big units.
Yeah, I mean, I destroyed one market by accident, but speed what it is. Assume final wave will come west, north, east, and then... I mean, I guess south here, but it can't... I mean, it feels like a bit could come here. Well, I guess it's kind of closed. I guess more here, but we probably built some defenses here too, just in case. And hope nothing comes through these little... I guess I'll... I'll wall there just in case. Oh. But I won't put any defenses there. Just so we buy some time and if something comes. Play some hunter quarters in the woods. I could for you. Great east walls. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of things we can still do, but we also have still a lot of time to do them. It's just. I wanted to have some walls in case of random waves on these sites. So, you know, I don't get murdered by accident or something. A timely reappearance. The dungeon awaits. Still always keep up with the YouTube. Hope you are well and happy in your year. Oh, and can. Hey, Jip Jamet. Oh, happy new year to you, too. <laughs> well, no cam. Uh, are you resorted to only YouTube? Obviously. Couldn't face the disappointment anymore. That makes sense. Busy with work when you stream normally. Oh, I'm just teasing. Makes perfect sense. Okay, well, let me build a bit more housing up here. Oh, I didn't claim this, but now, I mean, I can't get troops there because it's kind of blocked anyway. I should have destroyed this building actually, because now it's pointless. I mean, I guess I could still shoot it from the other side technically, but. Foundry too. Maybe we build two. What's the end game of this map? I assume there's gonna be a big wave at the end. I probably want to build defenses for that eventually. Exactly, either. I 
Man, a group of survivors are causing a ruckus at one of our gates. Call this in the survive saviors. They are demanding we hand over resources to them, else they would attack us. Yeah, good luck. We don't negotiate with ruffians and robbers. Drive them off. We could have just asked for help and we would have helped them. But we suffered heavy losses. We have to better prepare ourselves for the next encounter with them. What do you mean prepare ourselves? I have 600 snipers doing nothing. Send them after them. Okay, I'll I'll build some titans for them next time. Double wave, double zombie maps were cool. Yeah, I want to do more of the challenge maps too, eventually. Hey, Lucky Logi. I like maps that are a bit different, to be honest. I know I could build this nicer here too. Doesn't always have to be panic every 10 seconds. Honestly, I think this is a really nice map. Um, maybe it could have like had a few more um, zombies on the map, or like slightly bigger waves. But I wouldn't want this to be like a ridiculous hard map. I think it's pretty nice for what it is. And then a lot of people couldn't play it anyway if you made it like that. Happens when you're not Bill Gates. <laughs> yeah, how did they get into my base anyway, right? We have walls everywhere. Something is fishy. Is a fun custom in this style? Yeah, I agree. Uh, I guess we could get the lightning spire for some energy too. I should have just made all of this housing and then farming everywhere else, but oh well, that's what it is now. Also, I built the housing weird here. Like you have a spy in your armor, that could also be true. Yeah. Oh. One place where I can build. And just. I have stone doors, I do. There's not a lot of space for defenses up here. Maybe I'll destroy some stuff. Oh, there's also another oil. Just spend all my resources and you offer me food. Hey there, just arrived. What percentage is this map supposed to be? And it seems to have crushed it. It didn't have a... Like custom maps usually there is no good number. Wait, why are there um, red arrows on the map?
Maybe change the farms to stone house from the victorious. Yeah, I guess that would be ideal, right? A lot of moving stuff around, though. Okay, I'm only just gonna use the wood for food with the trade here, yeah, otherwise we're just trading forever. Oh, yeah, I guess apparently there's waves. That's why I wanted walls on these sides, just in case. They're not big, but I don't have any defenses there, so it's kind of awkward. <laughs> And that's also uh, another valuable free lesson I'll give you again. Don't trust map makers. This is where I have all my advanced farms, so building housing here means a lot of destroyed uh, food I have to rebuild. How much more people do need? Yes. What's the range on that? I actually pretty decently far. No, I don't want to demolish everything. Not today. I guess this is good enough. Oh, wait, I didn't upgrade my quarry. That's what I wanted to do earlier. Okay. Yeah, I guess we'll... Finish this as housing and then we just start unit production or something. Go ahead, delete it all. You know you want to. <laughs> it would be an interesting uh, final defense. I deleted it all. Still wood walls on the east side, yeah. It's not a priority here just yet. Like the walls upgrades are usually things where I'm like, I want to spend resources fast because I'm going to camp. And uh, that's just the fast way of doing it right now. Not necessarily a good investment at this point still. Saviors are back again and they're demanding more resources. 
We're ready for them now, yeah. I mean, we were ready last time, but... First squad, second squad, man the towers and just take out anyone who's holding a firearm. Let's show them who they're messing with. Well, I want you to bring a squad with you and flank them from the east. Cut them off. Make sure none of them escape. The rest of you men with me. Let's storm them head on. We are victorious. The following are our spoils of war. I mean victorious. Head, like facing them head on, we have like freaking walls and everything. <laughs> Still don't know how they are attacking me, but... No lack of food in this... No, and you... We could have bought even more from, from Jeffrey, right? No, Jeffrey is the colony, right? right? We, what was the guy's name? Either way, we could buy a ton of food. Um, We can also still upgrade. So I could have... Built a lot more housing too earlier. I, I thought we... Like, this was all the farming, and then... There wouldn't be much more after that, but yeah, there's a lot of farming on this map. Probably lost the first time because they were using gates. Yeah, that's amateurs. Amateurs. I don't have enough iron. Like, are there iron quarries I haven't upgraded? I think I have them all upgraded. Watch me. We can buy some. We should have a bit more space in the north for defenses, to be honest. I don't know if this is going to be good enough. We could destroy this too and build even more towers. Uh, stone jars are pretty expensive though. <laughs> Maybe I should build more than just that. Is the southwest is a pocket wave is not coming? I don't think so. Oh, four of the newer colonists have this being again and stolen my stuff. I mean, technically, there's entry points, so I've put some walls there just in case. But yeah, we'll emergency react to it if need be. I don't think anything will come here either because like the looks like this goes over here but we'll put some towers there just in case like a zombie shows up or we need to emergency do something about it Titan is here. Great. Yeah. 
that's all. The mighty Titan is here. Let's put this awesome body to use. Hmm. Nice Attention. cigar. Building completed. Yes, tell me what to kill. Hey. The sniper is ready. The mighty Titan is here. The mighty Titan is here. Oh, yeah, I built the wall stand out. That's okay. I probably, like, I have enough space for double walls here. I thought we, maybe we would get more snipers, but we're not. So I probably should have done that too. Well, oh, well. Not changing it now. Nice Shift-clicking tower would be an amazing That's thing. Yeah. To to fill them. The mighty titan is here. <laughs> I mean, they're probably way more coming up Titan here Titan than down here, here anyway. Bullseye. Uh, we're filling it for now. One. Let's put this awesome body to you. Sniper is ready. The mighty Titan is here. The mighty Titan is here. She's like, oh, we're getting close to the end, yeah. Commander, our camp is about to be completed soon. Can you give us this last material? <laughs> is the spice your lazy independent one? Like how there's more and more options to tell them to go away. But no, no, I'll help you. Bullseye. Let's go. The mighty Titan is here. The mighty Titan is here. Oh, they're blocked in here, huh? Production, maybe. Samuels are back and they're demanding more resources this time. Didn't we just kill them all last time? Of course, we fight them. Defense of the enclave was successful. Well, we should take the initiative and bring the fight to them. Trail them to their base and obliterate the threat once and for all. Yes. Commander base on the reports from our scouts. The Savior's base is approximately two uh, days away from here. Appearance. We lost many good men during the our skirmish as a chance to recruit and rearm ourselves instead. 
They really need someone better in charge of them attacking them. Wouldn't be this hard. Those raiders must be the best equipped raiders ever. They withstand my forces. I don't know if it lost like workers or something, but it didn't, didn't say so either, right? So. Oh, Vincent was the name, yeah. Who's supplying them? That is the real question. We probably have some traitors in our midst. Okay, well, we're getting a bunch of food here again until I cancel it by accident, and then probably the last time we trade anyway. Yeah, it's Vincent from the Jeffrey Colony, that's why uh, I mess up the names a bit. Okay, well that should be enough food for a while. Actually, I guess the iron I can kind of use anyway. Vincent knows the secret, how to produce sun and green or something. Yeah. With him in charge, uh, world hunger wouldn't be an issue. Problem would be solved in two days, Max. You know, it's the secret sauce. That probably too, yeah. Okay, well, most of my oil is used up for titans now. And a week later, all of the humans turn into something. It is consistent then with the story from uh, their buildings, isn't it? Where the food did uh, cause the zombies to begin with. Oh dear. The mighty titan is here. The sniper is ready. The sniper is ready. Let's go. The, the mighty is titan is here. Is it tea time already? Okay, how many snipers do we have here? I guess maybe more soldiers enters. 
Commander received reports from our scouts indicating zombie groups are attacking in increasing frequency and scale. I don't mean to sound superstitious, sir, but we have a fat feeling about this. Fair enough. That is earlier than um, they said it would happen, but... Okay. The mighty Titan is here. The mighty Titan is here. Attention. Yeah, I still have the janitors too. I mean, troops are spreading out, and I probably should build more towers on these sides here for the snipers or something. But now we're just investing the gold into troops. And Lucifer's outside the walls. So you want to kill them? That seems just rude. I guess they're coming more down here, right? Or somewhat here. The soldier hero in. Uh, there were two named units. Uh, um, I might have lost one. Yeah, I guess I lost the named soldier. Sniper is ready. Um, we only have the the named ranger left. I used up all the oil. At least, assuming I claimed all the oil pools on the map. I don't see any other ones, but that doesn't mean they aren't there. Hello. Jolly good. Sniper is ready. Indeed. Good idea, sir. The mighty Titan Let's is here. Go. Yes, tell me what to kill. The mighty Titan is here. Build a second oil one was thing for No, I couldn't repair the other um workshops. And it doesn't show the research anymore even if I select them anyway. Is it too late for a thousand wasp for no reason at all? I'd say so. It's always Well not too late, it's always too early for that. The other way around. Pretty now what I'm doing, but might be helpful. Titans. I guess they were still in production, that's why they're showing up now. Let's say have yum or have fun on the minimap in the northeast. Oh, yes, I didn't even see that. <laughs> Uh, the people, uh, there's the commotion at the gates. Yeah, yeah. 
No, oh, no, it's fun. Didn't even notice that. There's no over preparing. There's always just barely enough. I mean, also, I, I misbuilt these defense, right? There should have been like two rows of walls minimum, so. This is weaker than it should be. Like, giants can nearly clear leave my defenses, by the way. But I was too lazy to rebuild. Thought we would have more troops, more snipers. But I was a bit late with building up, um, expanding more. Because again, I was looking for that housing area that never, never appeared. I guess I should at least move the Titans like one step back, right? So in case there are giants, they don't get cleaved down immediately. Will I play another map after this one? Uh, probably not. I'm currently, I don't want to sit too long. Um, so it's just going to be one map. Even even with my special pillow, it's still not ideal to sit for long. It's like I'll back at least. I assume the next wave is final wave. We'll have to see what's in there. It didn't say. Hello. Good morning, sir. Well, we'll just have to find out On together. Is it tea Three harpies? Already? Well, that would be nice, wouldn't it? Hello. I'd be prepared for three harpies. Let's go. Good morning, sir. Is it tea time it's not about a standing desk or an electrical one, so you can change from standing and sitting with me. I do have a standing desk, uh, even an electrical one. Yeah, I do that. Um... Oh, nice. Our puppy brought food again. It's not a lot, but, you know, it's for morale. Um, but I also can't stand all day because uh, I also have a leg injury right now. So, But I do switch between standing, sitting, walking, and then lying down all the time. <laughs> Um, but yeah, things aren't ideal right now. Uh, let's put the on high target priority at least, everyone. But yeah, I, sh I should use the standing desk part a bit more again. Well, I did say the Waves get increasingly stronger, so I assume there's going to be a few waves. Now, priority report, sir. Advanced scouts have relayed a message indicating a massive horde of over 4,000 zombies are heading towards our enclave. And sir, there is more. There are behemoths in the horde, sir. Multiple. They are estimated to arrive at our enclave in 10 days. What spurs is that the scouts believe this massive force is just a vanguard. Okay. Oh, I guess we have more time than I thought we would. A steadfast supporter. But I guess that means more snipers. Snipers. 
So destroying all these zombies with an injury line. Well, I'm just, you know, sitting nicely or standing in one of those stone towers, shooting them. He thinks this is going to go until the 100. It could be. Could be a 100 day map. Who do you want me to punish? I didn't check that, to be honest. I probably should have. But again, it's again, it's also it's an old school map, right? It, like it was made before. I think it was made before, like there were unit upgrades or zombie upgrades, and um, like the option in the map editor for that. Which doesn't. I mean, even then, when it's available, you don't have to use that anyway. But. Might also be why like there's no info on waves or anything. I think they got more popular later on to tell you what's coming. Then again, that's also more of a thing in custom maps that are more rigid where you can build. I like this one. Like it's it's a pretty nice layout. If I'd play it again, I'd make one massive housing area probably here combined. Like, move this to over here. Attention. Build more housing in general earlier. Lots of room for improvement. Okay, let's keep us the food up. And we took the um, power plant energy supply, but the map is 100 days that two, two workers for stone housing would have been better too. Can't fit all the snipers down here. This is terrible territory. Aim this up here. It's kind of hard fitting, fitting stuff in. The pup now have more time to look for things. Yeah, I can just go play with him a bit. And you know, someone else can deal with that zombie apocalypse. Sounds like a good plan to me. My economy dropped a lot. We were at like 15k income at some point. I guess that army cost is ramping up slowly. Again, the reason to build my housing earlier. Upside is we're gonna get to those 2,000 snipers. I can't um, keep up with sniper production anymore, I think. I don't have enough gold income to continuously um, build it. Maybe it was because I was building some housing too, though. Going on a boat. Well, if we move the command center to like here, that would be a pretty good spot to defend. Like a lot of the zombies would... Well, I guess you would defend here. now. it's not ideal either. And technically, this looks a bit open there. I guess this is actually a pretty good spot for the command center up here. For once, someone put it in a good location. What can I do for you, sir? Okay. Does anyone know how long the map is? 
I don't think it said on Steam, right? Did it? Let me check, I guess. We're building some snipers. Uh, where is it? There. No, it doesn't say there either. Okay. Yeah, I definitely had time to like build more more stone houses. Well, I still have time, but lazy me doesn't want to. Eh, let's build some extra ones here. Problem is this side. If this the other sides fall, we can still move stuff there, right? The north falls, then well, we just die immediately. Which is kind of inconvenient. I'd prefer not to die. Two thousand nineteen is one of the oldest. Yeah. I, I found it more by accident, like uh, one of Ibitz's videos popped up in my YouTube feed. Uh, I was like, oh, I don't know this map. Like, oh, I, oh, and then I didn't really watch the video. I was like, well, let's just play it. Yes. It looked interesting from the premise. But yeah, I could have checked there um, how long the map is. <laughs> like, see how what day the final wave is. Game's next wife is final. Okay, that's good then. Seen that video? I didn't want to spoil it. For me. Ah, okay. Yeah, I, I mean, I usually prefer non non spoilers. So thanks, appreciate that. But it is also good to know when the final wave is. It bad general points that Nozom has reached the first row of towers on any side. Uh, I would bet against that. I'm pretty sure they're gonna kill a few of my units, for sure. I did say there's giants in there, and the giants will reach my defenses and kill some stuff. The question is how many giants, and that depends um, how the defense goes. The dungeon awaits. Of course, sir. I didn't want the titans too close forward here, but I need, if I wanted more troops in here, I kinda need to squeeze it in. Same hate spoilers, I understand it. Yeah, I don't know why that people want to spoil all the time. Like, half the fun, at least to me, when I watch someone, is seeing them figure it out. I mean, sometimes it can be useful to be like, I don't know, you're doing a puzzle on stream and you just can't figure it out. And then usually I'd be like, okay, I come back here later. Or maybe even take a break from the game, think about it, and come back. Which, you know, isn't really a thing to do on stream. So. But even then, like, always wait until, until the streamer's like, yeah, okay, help me. <laughs> but like, oh yeah, probably was um, Ryan Dale Billions. Like a few days ago I saw that. And people were spoiling so much, or trying to spoil so much, instead of just... Letting him figure it out. Which I found interesting to see, like what, what he goes for and builds. And obviously, he played terrible. Because, you know, he's new to the game. That's expected. But it was interesting to make him. Even on, like, his. I think it was his first or second run. I didn't see everything, but he recognized a few things relatively early, like what's good or bad. And. A, a few more runs, he would be really good on it, too. Okay, well, we're prepared. More stone towers, even. Sniper is ready. 
But yeah, I mean, it also depends on the streamer too, right? I know sometimes streamers have like VRP spec seat or something in there too, so it's fair enough. But I think the stem rate assumption should be don't spoil until asked or you know they want to be spoiled. Most interesting, I always find when people like want to spoil or advise stuff, but their advice is just wrong. <laughs> But they don't realize it, so they're very confident in their wrong opinions they're trying to share. The, the bug when it looks like there are two in a tower, but there's four. Yeah, that's a crucial bug, I would say. Like up here, you mean. Like you can see the other snipers, um, like this one. He's not outside, he's just visually behind there. Like that's a bug. But they're still shooting, um, so it's fine. I, I don't know if you unload and reload them, if it then fixes it. Yeah, it can fix it. But yeah, like, most of these towers should have four in them, even if it doesn't look like it. I couldn't... So, I got one free market and bank. Those are the ones I built here. And then I never got any free ones. And I couldn't tech for a market or bank. So I could only use the ones on the map, which are the ones down here. Um, so yeah, these are the only ones I got to choose. And then I deleted one market down here by accident. Well, the Lucifers burned it down. <laughs> See, that's why we don't lose, use Lucifers here. We don't want a food, I guess. We upgrade some farming. I still have quite a few farms actually left I could upgrade, so... Could have used... Um, could have had a bigger army. Do I still have, like... Normal energy mills to upgrade? Mm. I don't see any. And again, I still have a bit of space. Oh no, there are some. Yeah, there are some barrels here too. Uh, I didn't use them. I hope I didn't leave any in um, my defenses by accident. I've had that before where a spitter like, there was like a barrel here in the defense, and then a spitter shot the barrel and exploded all half my defenses. Nearly killed me. Fun times. Final wave take two. Maybe this time we're correct. Yeah, let's put everyone again, everyone new on high target party too. Oh boy, oh no. Well, there's stuff coming here. Wait, they're spawning in here too? What? Well, that's just nasty. Okay, some stuff is coming in here too, but again, like, that's less of an issue, right? I don't want to pull too many troops down here. And they're hiding behind the wall here. Okay. Looking at the north, that looks fine. This is not reaching us, this is fine too. Can't trust my Megas. <laughs> yeah, I mean... I thought a few would come here, but I guess he spawned them pretty close, so they would come up there. Oh, still not getting in here.
Doesn't say another wave is coming, but you know, don't trust map makers, rebuild those defenses. Okay, these sides are looking good though. Uh, this side here might be in trouble. Funnily enough, the harpies can't jump. See, that's why if you, um, like with Wasp, you could do the same thing where the harpies can't jump, so they're blocking all the zombies here. Nothing's happening. <laughs> I wish they would change that too, where um, harpies then would just attack more. Like, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. That's why I sometimes don't get the custom maps with the harpy waves, but you just build wasps in your travel, but that kind of defeats the point of it too. Okay, you guys go chase. Okay. They, they had the base here before we even expanded there. They clearly didn't know where to build build it base. We built ours in a good location. Nothing came from the top here though, so you know, that was good. <laughs> that could have actually killed me if something came there. I mean, we had some walls and I could have built a few more, but yeah. And I did have a few troops nearby just in case. Wait, they can't jump over wasps, but no, no, they can't jump over three tiles. So, um, normally you can only build like two tiles walls, right? You can build like if you build like this, then you can't build enough walls here. So the harpies could jump in here, but if you now put wasps there, then they can't jump there. Or alternatively, you could um, put gates there too, and that works as well. Uh. Like not here, but you could like if you build gates like this, they can't jump over it either. You you can cheese harpies if you want to. I don't recommend doing it because it, it makes it more boring. Um, it feels a bit exploitive to me, but yeah, it is possible. Oops, one zombie in here. I hope the map kills him, so we can get a victory screen. I didn't build gates. They never finished, it doesn't count. Okay. Doesn't count. Maybe I do, do I still have the Lucifers? Yeah. I don't know if they reach there, but we can try. Repair house. I mean, I could start. Actually, I don't have gold to repair. <laughs> We're gonna lose a lot of troops in a second, I guess. Oh no, I don't have workers. I, yeah, I can't repair because I don't have workers. Which I guess troops deserting will get workers. There we go. Nice map. I liked it. A bit on the easier side for me, but... Pretty nice design. 